not quite sure how I want to do this. It's got such an interesting texture to it. I'm going to use this one. It's a little too bright for this piece. But I think between leaf green and green tea, I think I can achieve the proper coloration. Wow, that's impressive, Crackman. I think the fact that you kept the fish alive for 13 years is pretty impressive, too. <laughs> and what was that hard lesson, Primitive? Well, when you're six, can you really be expected to... <laughs> that, that's funny, Crackman. But primitive, when, you, when you're six, can you be really expected to know better than to put a snapping turtle in the same tank as your father's very, very expensive fish? You just wanted all to swim together. You didn't know. I hope. It'd be kind of bad if you knew that that would happen. You still did it. Uh-oh. Even at such a young age. Wow. That's impressive. I mean, the, the, your goldfish killed another goldfish. One of the tiny shark fish, which I think is... I wonder if it's like one of the little catfish like what I had. A sucker fish, which is actually there's little sucker fishes that clean the, the sides of the tanks. That's actually kind of catfish too. We had a few of those. I had a hard time. We had a an aquarium for a couple years. Started out as my gestational carriers and my father's, and then they gave up on it. Well, certain people gave up on it, so I took it over. It was going great, going good, going great. We're fine. The filter broke. Okay, fix the filter. Put a new one in. Going great, going fine. No, no, they're all dying now. I don't know what happened. I probably should have tested the water levels and all that, but there was a lot going on at the time, so. Things happened. They all died. I didn't feel that bad. I felt bad, I failed them, and they died and under my care, but I had a lot more stressful things on my plate than worrying about 
a tank full of fish. So we'll just leave it at having dog. Odd as it sounds, it's easier. Me. <laughs> the fish was literally jaws. It was a giant shark that ate people. That was a cough, really, from it. But thank you. So is it too personal a question to ask why you hated your father? Fancy. Actually, I'm regretting the glitter. I, I prefer just straight up red. But I was, I was feeling glittery. I'm not anymore. Now I'm stuck with it until I chip it all off. How are you doing tonight, Lily's mom? Could you let middle child know that it's 11 now? Would you let middle child know that it's 11? Please and thank you. <laughs> I am doing quite well. Thank you, dear. Sorry, hear that lemony. Could you trace it? Because I knew you could start fresh with the inking. If you have a tablet, you can put your piece of paper on top of it, with just so like a white screen on it. It was just the gentleman. I'm growing mine out for now. It's actually gotten quite long. See? It's long, man. So long. See, you can't even see it.
Ah, I see. I understand primitive. More on the maternal side of issues, though. <laughs> yeah, if you're sitting on it, might be time for a trim. Well, you remember how my, how long mine used to be? I think I had you be. You could totally, you could trim it yourself. Wouldn't be too bad. Just a quick clip of the ends. <laughs> Only by about three feet. One day I'll show you all what she's talking about. Um, I don't know, actually. I was just doing it because I wanted to. A lot of things I don't actually have a plan for until it's done. I don't want to get ahead of myself there. Maybe I'll throw this one in the, the shop for decals. Because it's, it's styled, right? Nothing around it. It could go against a wall. Do it huge so that the uh, mantis is like that big. I don't think we have any mantises in the shop, so that would be good for it. <laughs> that would be pretty. I like that idea. I could do it with what I've got, too. Then randomly throw the mantis in there to mess with people. I like that idea. Yep. Bed now. <laughs> <laughs> 